You've been told to eat less and move more, right? You've probably even been sold on the fat burning zone and hours of boring cardio. You're not alone. In today's video, I'm revealing the shocking truth about fat loss, what you should eat, and the exact workout strategy by which my clients have seen visible results within 30 days. Plus, I will reveal a science-backed tool that can help you lose fat effectively and sustainably. Now, before we dive into the myths holding you back, let's talk about what the pros really do differently. They don't just work harder, they work smarter. They use a few simple scientific principles to burn fat efficiently and, more importantly, keep it off for good. And the first principle is clearing up the confusion around one of the most popular myths out there, fasted cardio. The idea that you'll burn more fat by running on an empty stomach is everywhere. And technically, it's true that you might increase fat burning during that specific workout. But when researchers look at the big picture, long-term studies show no significant difference in total fat loss between people who do fasted cardio and those who eat first, as long as daily calories are matched. So, if fasted cardio isn't the secret, what actually makes the difference? Let's look at what science really shows. No workout on Earth, no matter how intense, can outperform a bad diet. The fundamental, unbreakable law of fat loss is a calorie deficit. You have to consume fewer calories than your body burns. There are no magic foods that just melt fat away. But here's the tricky part. Are you actually eating what you think you are? Studies show most people underestimate their calories by up to 30%. That's like eating an extra meal every single day without realizing it. And that's where Cal AI makes life way easier. With Cal AI, you can literally snap a photo of your meal and the app instantly breaks down calories and macros for you. From my experience, it's accurate, but I always check the ingredients after the scan and make sure to add anything it might have missed. It includes a full food database with thousands of items and ingredients to choose from. Plus my favorite feature, the barcode scanner for packaged foods. Whether it's a quick lunch or a late night snack, you'll always know exactly what's going into your body. That accuracy means you can finally see if you're in a calorie deficit, which is the real driver of fat loss. And the best part? Cal AI adjusts to your eating habits over time, so tracking becomes faster and smarter the more you use it. Instead of stressing over math, you can focus on training, recovery, and actually living your life. Scan the QR code on screen or use the link in the description to try Cal AI today. And because you're here, use promo code DUMBBELL to unlock a free three-day trial. Now, let's tackle the old debate between cardio and weights. Doing only one is a rookie mistake. Here's how you should think about it. Cardio is fantastic for burning calories during the exercise itself, but strength training is what turns your body into a 24-7 fat-burning machine. Lifting weights builds and maintains lean muscle, and muscle is metabolically active. The more muscle you have, the higher your resting metabolic rate, meaning you burn more calories all day long, even when you're just sitting on the couch. The most effective approach, backed by science, is combining both. Shoot for two to three strength training sessions per week and supplement that with some moderate cardio or a few high-intensity interval training height sessions. By the way, if you're finding these myth-busting tips valuable, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button. I release science-backed videos every single week to help you get real results without all the hype. All right, let's talk about the fat you really want to lose, that stubborn fat on your belly. You could do a thousand crunches a day, and it wouldn't make a dent. The concept of spot reduction, or losing fat from one specific area, is a complete myth. When your body loses fat, it takes it from all over, in a pattern determined by your genetics, not by the exercises you do. The good news, however, is that visceral fat, the dangerous kind stored around your organs, is often the first type of fat to go when you start a solid diet and exercise plan. So, stop wasting time on targeted belly fat exercises. Focus on a consistent, full-body workout plan and a smart nutrition strategy. As your overall body fat percentage drops, your belly fat will too. You can have the perfect diet and the perfect workout plan, but if you ignore these next two factors, you will struggle. I'm talking about sleep and stress. When you don't get enough quality sleep, your body's hormones go into chaos. It pumps up the hormone that makes you hungry while shutting down leptin, the hormone that tells you you're full. Chronic stress is just as bad. It spikes your cortisol levels 
a hormone that directly promotes fat storage, particularly in your midsection. The pro-level approach to fat loss is holistic, prioritizing seven to eight hours of quality sleep and finding ways to manage your stress aren't luxuries. They are non-negotiable parts of the process. So it's time to forget the outdated advice. The science of losing fat like a pro is all about working smarter. It boils down to these core principles. Maintain a consistent calorie deficit fueled by a high protein diet of whole foods. Combine strength training and cardio to maximize your metabolism around the clock. And finally, manage your sleep and stress to keep your hormones working with you, not against you. Stop chasing quick fixes and start building sustainable habits. That's where lasting results come from. You have the science. Now go put it to work.